This is the vegan anarchist here with another video, man. Another video. This question, I had a question from one of my friends I've known since high school about it basically it's this why do you hate authority so much, you know? And, and at the time I didn't answer, he answered a crap answer. Oh, it infringes on my autonomy and my freedom. And they were like, but. You're free to like walk here right now. Oh, is that college? I go to this class, so it can't be that much. But then, I but then he's the real answer. It's not that I'm against authority. It's that authority is against me. Authority is against you. I don't like authority. No, it's not that I don't like authority. It's that authority hates my ass and sees me as a tool. Mmm. You're wondering. What authority? Uh, the authority. I'm gonna call it the man. Refer to it in the left, uh, the 60s and 70s. The man. Whether it be the man if corporations or the man that's the president. It's the man. The man is the one that wants me to work for the rest of my life and to at least I'm retirement age, only to rip me off of my pension. And have you work and waste my life away for, and for subsistent wages. It's the man that extorts me through rents and taxes. It is the man that makes me want, that wants to join, makes me, that tries to indoctrinate me to join the military just so the man can make extra money. It's the man that's against us. To be blunt, we didn't start the class war. Anarchists and Marxists did not start the class war. The bourgeoisie did. It started since the agricultural revolution. They started it. We're going to end it. You see that? Okay? And you're wondering, the class war, yeah. Because the secret is, authority cares more about its own power than it does you, me, or anyone else. All it cares is about itself. And people are fucking selfish. You shouldn't trust about authority, okay? Especially in the capitalism, you're fucking selfish. My dad's not gonna say it though, it was really annoying. Anyways. Um. Yeah, authority. It is uh, because of someone's authority that the Holocaust happened. It is because of authority that, I don't know, uh, let's see, name, name a. Name a name a, a disaster uh, like a Holocaust or a genocide. More harm has been done by people who follow orders than people who take orders. Even if it's a bureaucracy, it doesn't matter. Following orders can lead to problems. So thus, we need to abolish authority. And well, authority. I mean, I don't mean the authority like oh, I. An authority in guitar because I'm a, a wizard in guitar and I'm the best. Or I'm the authority in anthropology because I've dedicated my whole adult life on anthropology. Not that authority. Not even the authority of, I have authority over this fender. I mean authority like the ability to tell and coerce someone what to do. And even then, you know, so much that we society needs but then again, it's always up to us, the anarchists, who are skeptical. And when we see a problem and you can't justify, we go after them. We must abolish authority. You don't need no vanguard to tell us how to do a revolution, because the secret is, I believe in revolutionary spontaneity. All we need to do is just inform, educate, organize, and agitate the working class. And for that, we will get the revolution. For that, we will get mass veganism. But it's only if, if you are willing to take up arms against the people who abuse us every freaking day and extort us, kill us, fight, make other people fight. It doesn't matter to you scumbags. You know, if politicians want to war profiteers want to fight a war, how will they send their ass to war? Why do the working class or anybody else have to volunteer to do their work, dirty work? Shouldn't even have a profit, they have to profit on me. So in essence, this is the vegan anarchist. No meat, no milk, no masses. See ya, see ya at the barricade smashing authoritarianism. See ya.
Yeah.